Playing 11 years for the Eagles, three-time Pro Bowler Trey Thomas is used to thinking quickly on his feet. After his Cherry Hill business, Pino's palate was shut down due to the coronavirus. Thomas caught an audible on the fly. We're just like every other business, you know, that, that knows like, you know, right now is a tight time. You know, you're not able to open your doors and have people in your in your space. So, you know, we just like everybody else had to find a creative way to try to keep things going to bring some money in. The nice curvature here. The former Eagles been doing virtual painting classes, including last night, teaming up with Eagles tight end Zach Ertz and his wife Julie for a session with fans to raise money for charity. They painted an eagle. So this is pretty much what our beak is going to be, but now we're going to get into the eye area. It was a lot of fun, you know, just to, you know, see how Julie and Zach to, to sit down and take them through the painting and see how it, how they came out with it. Showtime, let's see, let's see. What do we come up with? All right, here we go, here's mine. Fast start. Oh, no, yeah! There you go. People really responded to it, and I think everybody had a good time. Their paintings came out well. Uh, I, I think I, I want to pat myself on the back right there for being a great instructor and getting everybody through it, but nah, but it was a lot of fun. For $86, Ertz's number, 189 Eagles fans signed up for the virtual class. They were sent the canvas and painting supplies. Trey hosted the two-hour session. It was a hit. Trey Thomas, he'll tell you he can't paint, but he can paint. Like, he was so entertaining and so awesome. And the whole process was just having Zach and Julie and Trey like in your, on your Zoom was just incredible. When you're doing a virtual class, you don't have people right there in front of you. So you have to have some type of energy about you instead of just sitting there like, all right, we're just gonna paint, you know. Where everybody's coming to it for an outlet and have some energy and to have fun. So I wanted to make sure that we had that type of energy and had a good time. Three years into owning a small business, this is Thomas's biggest challenge, but he's trying to brush it off like he did Defenders. Jeff Skaversky, Channel 6, Action News.